Hey, oh everyone, it's Azrael, and uh, I was gonna do a live commentary here for you because I finally played uh, Lucky Block Bed Wars, but then uh, my OBS decided to completely crap out on doing uh, microphone audio. So here we are. Um, but uh, yeah, the TwistMC server hasn't been getting a lot, a lot of traffic lately, uh, and I, I just haven't put any effort into figuring out when. Uh, life is recording so i just i don't have a video on that for this week but i figured while i'm at it might as well do some live commentary obviously that doesn't work so uh yeah i'm just gonna have some footage uh, running in the background as i talk about the game um most notably this was essentially just a free bed over here um sadly the other guy respawned but uh that was that, that was easy not even close not even close. See? Combo. But have, have you ever noticed uh, most of the uh, professional players can get killed by skeletons and not actual other players? Like, un unless they're playing with someone sweaty. They, they never get they never get hit by players. Um, so, uh, next, of course, I hit the... I hit my friend with a, with a hot potato, as always. Um... I was thinking about trying to fake out red, but then they got wise and I, I needed to hit them off before I could actually start mining because I knew that would make way too much noise, but uh, they just decided it's not it's not the day for knockback. Uh, just gathering resources, then I hop over uh, back at their base. I'm trying to help Blue here. See, uh, here's, here's something I find interesting. People claim it to be cross-teaming when you and your enemy work together. We didn't talk in chat or anything. I knew he was going to drop TNT. So I just went over, comboed the guy. Uh, so they could get the bed easier. And uh, thankfully no one called me out for cross-teaming this time. But I sort of didn't like it that immediately after I helped them. I mean, like, I killed the guy, but they just immediately came after me. Which, I totally won that fight. Um, then just just coming through here. Uh, I, try, I try not smart him going through the center. I, I thought he was gonna try and bait me and uh, knock me off the edge if I went if I just directly followed him. Uh, then I remembered something Technoblade said during this fight, uh, and then promptly tossed it out the window because I'm an idiot. Uh, essentially, whenever you want it, whenever you're doing PvP, you want to have the low ground because you're you're you have slightly longer reach than the opponent does at that point, uh, which I started the fight with, uh, and then he placed a block which I naturally jumped up on and that uh yeah that that obviously worked out but only just barely I would I would have liked it to have been a whole lot uh whole lot uh better um I went middle I grabbed some emeralds uh, by killing a couple guys um I bought some armor and I bought potions because everyone knows potions are the way to win the game uh and then I bought myself an Ender Pearl. Now I'm not the best at Ender Pearls since I stopped playing Sky Wars, but I figured I might as well keep doing it because it's more likely to save me than just falling off the edge. Well, this guy decides to rush Pearl, and I don't know what he was thinking about doing, but he just went right off the edge. Uh, and sadly, that was before we could get their bed. But um, yeah, they got our bed. We got their bed. So now it's just a two v two. Um. I ran back to our base. So, uh, the guy on a bridge there, he decides to just launch me, which I have slime boots, so I was fine anyways, but uh, it was pretty cool to just land on top of the building. Uh, pull out my jump five, pull out my invis, and I go to chase after this guy, but um, he just he just decides to finish the game. And so that's that, that was just the win. Um, and that is why I don't end a brawl, by the way. 